guys welcome back to a new video if you're new here i'm emily i'm a flight attendant and a health coach and if you've heard me say that so many times i'm sorry i just want everyone new to feel welcome and to know kind of what's going on i'm currently in santa barbara california on a four-day flight attendant trip i'm position two i set up everything in the back galley for service we're on the airbus 319 which we refer to lovingly as the baby bus never been to santa barbara so i'm going to take you guys with me i woke up with my interstitial cystitis if you don't know what that is it's like a really painful bladder condition that just flares up randomly i have done really well to manage it most of the time but when i don't sleep well my body's all over the place physically and mentally i'm all over the place i'm gonna go get some food at ah juice organic and see where the day takes us i hope you guys are doing well my nephew was born when i was home for people that know what i'm talking about he is beautiful and i'm so thankful that my sister had an easy delivery and that he is healthy and we'll see you later When I read about this raw apple pie, I had to walk and get it. I walked like almost 30 minutes to get it. Well, look at that thing. That is a raw apple pie, y'all. Made with a walnut and date crust and obviously apples and cinnamon. Very excited to try this. But I'm gonna change and get on over to the beach. Y'all, every single flight is delayed, I'm telling you. Why can't this flight to Phoenix be delayed and let us stay in Santa Barbara longer? But anyways, that's how it is. At least I have my raw apple pie to enjoy when I'm so tired later. And I've had a really good day, so I hope you have. I will see you on the beach. Hey guys, so my trip did not go as planned. I was supposed to lay over in Kansas City. I actually ended up laying over in Philadelphia once I worked my flight from Austin to Philadelphia. I got really sick on the flight and I was just trying to push through, work the trip, but my body was fighting me so hard I couldn't work. I didn't want to put extra work on my coworkers and I didn't want to be stuck in the bathroom the whole flight so i just had to make a decision it was very difficult because i didn't want to get off the train needed the hours but i unfortunately just couldn't finish it so i ended up calling out sick when i landed in philadelphia and they did have a standby and he got there on time and everything so i'm thankful for that but in general if you're dealing with any kind of chronic illness you know how draining physically and emotionally it is and it just makes me feel like a failure a lot and I can't do what I want to do because I'm feeling that way. But I'm trying to remember that none of that is true and I just need to be more gentle with myself and rest when that happens and that's what I've been trying to do. Thank you so much for watching and I'm going to show you something that I discovered that's really yummy. I'll be right back. I would say this is even better than normal ice cream. This is the Cosmic Bliss dark chocolate one. It's so delicious. And the ingredients are literally coconut milk, 
cocoa, coconut syrup, and vanilla extract. And it's all organic. Love that. And then we have the legendary cookie dough. It truly is legendary. Oh my gosh, I can't even explain. This has big chunks of gluten-free, vegan, refined sugar-free cookie dough in it. And like chocolate chunks. Let me just show you. I've already enjoyed a lot of it. You see that right there? That's a chunk of cookie dough. I don't know why it makes me so happy. I haven't had cookie dough ice cream since I was a little kid. So it just healed something in me. My inner child was so happy. I don't know. This is the vanilla bean. I don't know if you can see the little flecks of vanilla bean. Tastes like normal vanilla ice cream, but just better. And then let me show you the chocolate one. But I got it at Sprouts. They didn't have it at Whole Foods. So if you have a Sprouts close by, you can get the ice cream there. They do also have a few flavors that are made with grass-fed dairy if you prefer that but i'm in love and i will continue buying these sorry the video didn't go as planned but i will see you next time i really appreciate you i don't know there's so much i need to say but we're gonna end it with that see you next time